I had a chance to speak with this year's national ESAP winner soon after the award was announced. I'm standing here with this year's Environmental Stewardship Award Program winners, the Masonic Village Farms of Pennsylvania. Gentlemen, how does it feel to be this year's award recipients from such a competitive group? We're very honored to be part. It, it, it is a competitive group. We've met these people all summer long in the other events, and, and any one of the farms could have been an exceptional winner. Uh, we're honored, humbled, uh, rewarded. It, there's a whole bunch of words. We're certainly in cloud nine right now, but we do appreciate it. Tell us this. What do you think differentiated you from some of the others, and, and, and why do you think um, a Masonic Village Farms was, was somewhat unique in what you've done from an environmental standpoint? Well, Kevin, uh, as Jerry said, everyone is deserving of this, of the, of the six people that were there. Um, we try to do things in a very sound way with whatever we do. The treatment of our cattle, the treatment of our crops, the treatment of our land. And we try to be very, very responsible because our operation has been there for 101 years, and we want it to be there for another 101 years. Outstanding. And another question I'm interested in, you know, as you think about what other cattlemen may be thinking at home, gosh, I could never be one of those award recipients, what would you want other cattlemen to know about the Environmental Stewardship Award and, and, and just being environmentally friendly in this business? We've been helped by a lot of groups over the, the, this period of years. Um, the NRCS and other people have advised us in ways that it's easy to do. Little changes mean a lot. And if we can do the right things, set the place up in a, the right way, it's better for the cattle all around. And it, it works better for, for all our neighbors and everybody downstream and things like that that really um, make it easy to do the right thing. You know, I think you made a comment about green grass and blue sky that really summarizes what we're trying to do with this Environmental Stewardship Award. you want to share that with our viewers? Sure, Kevin. Um, we try to take blue sky and green grass and make red meat and try to do it as environmentally sound as we can. And the result is a protein that we can feed the nation with. I couldn't see it better myself. And there you have it, the 2011 Environmental Stewardship Award winners. Find out how you can enter this year's Environmental Stewardship Awards program by going to our website at cattlemantocattlemen.org.